The Slavitooth decision was uh, rendered today by the Federal Court of Appeal. This case has always been about First Nations rights. This has always been about the Slavitooth asserting their view that the NEB process was flawed and did not take into consideration their rights and title. BC entered this appeal uh, early, uh, late in the day uh, after being sworn in last, um, last summer. We did so to support the Slavitooth, but also when you're an intervener, of course, you have to add to the arguments. We put forward our arguments in good faith. Uh, they were not supported today by the Supreme Court, but the substance of the case was. What that means, of course, for British Columbia is that our coast is considered to be an integral part of the decision-making process and marine traffic was not adequately assessed by the NEB or by the Ordering Council to proceed with Kinder Morgan. What that means today is a great day for the Slavitooth and I would argue for those in British Columbia who have been saying for many years now that the NEB process was flawed and that the consequences of a spill were significant have been vindicated. I believe that uh, as we go forward, we need to focus on the things that unite us as Canadians, the things that bring us together in this great country so that we can build the economy, not just one component of the economy, but every sector. Again, uh, for the Slaywatooth, congratulations on a hard-fought court victory. I'm confident that there will be those that will have differing opinions over the days and weeks ahead, but I would hope that all Canadians would understand and recognize that here in British Columbia, uh, Indigenous rights are issues that we need to address and we will continue to do that as a government.